Sup guys, this is Frenalations here for a very special video. Uh, June 28th, 2008, I posted my first Nike SB video. I sat here in the same spot and reviewed these same shoes. And I had said it's the first of many shoe reviews. Little did I know how true that was going to be. Uh, 200 videos later, 2 million views later, 2 years later, uh, I've, you know, consistently be, been bringing out videos for you guys, and I hope to continue to do the same thing. I really want to, you know, thank all of you guys for supporting me and uh, watching the videos over the years. Uh, the biggest, like, inspiration when I first started was Sneak Geeks. I saw him doing his reviews at the time of the countdown packs before they came out, and uh, I've always been in the Nike SB. So I just wanted to give you guys the best reviews I could of the newest releases. This was the first release at the time. I got these at Broken Project. I camped out uh, with my friend uh, Rizzle Ray, my other friend Toy Box. Uh, I met two people that are still friends to this day in that lineup, that being uh, Tay and Thompson. So um, yeah, just I once again I want to thank all you guys and let's get into the review. Starting off over here with the Cooler Hari Dunks. These released at Broken Projects. I actually got these a few months before that release. Found them on eBay. I believe they released in Mexico. Uh, inspired off of the bike from ET. So on the back, it's got this black tab with the white basket from ET. Uh, most of the upper is all patent leather, except for the swoosh. It's just a white leather. So you got your red patent leather, which starts to have a gradient effect from pink to white, right here on, on the toe box. It's got that red stitching all throughout the patent leather area. So on the back, all throughout the white area, all that. I have the white laces on it. You got your red tongue, red Nike SB patch with the white stitching, uh, red and white zoom air sole with the black sock lining, white midsole, black stitching, black bottom. Dope shoe for sure. Next, uh, probably my favorite out of the pack, the Michael Lau Blazers. Uh, I like it for its subtle detail. Really dope shoe. And let's get into it. So the tongue, you have a red tumbled leather tongue with china stitched in in black and yellow. Then you have this really cool lace lock. It's supposed to be like the handle um, handlebars from a BMX bike. So you got BMX on each side with the stars. The midsole, you got a white midsole all the way around with this uh, yellow line going through it and the yellow line on that side right, right there as well. A very nice yellow tumbled leather all throughout the upper. The swoosh, however, is a yellow suede, very soft. You have this nice um, stitching of the sun pattern right all throughout the shoe right there. On the back, it says Beijing VMX 2008. And you have this really cool suede pattern right there in gray on the back tab. Uh, red inside lining with a cool Nike SB insole. You got the Nike SB in gold right there. And of course the gum bottom. Very dope. Uh, when I was talking about the subtle detail, right here on the side you actually have stars pushed in, indented into the leather. And that's you know something very unusual for a Nike SB shoe. I really like it and really dope shoe. Next, a lot of people were really you know excited for the the dunks at the time, the Trickstar dunks, and I said it even then, the, the Blazers were the better shoe out of the pack, and I could be mistaken, but I, I'm pretty sure these even go for a slightly higher price now. This shoe is just m much more wearable, it's a really nice shoe, and let's get into it. Starting with that gum bottom, you gotta love the gum bottom. White midsole, the whole upper is this black nubuck with a star indent indented pattern, the stars kind of shine off the shoe, which is really nice. You have a golden patent leather swoosh. Very nice. On the back, black patent leather with Nike stitched in in black. That tongue is the same new buck with the star pattern. Uh, black tag right there with Nike SB stitched in gold. Black inner lining with a very cool insole. It says Nike SB and it has a gradient star pattern going from gold to white up towards the toes. Very nice. Next, the Dunk Glow. It looks really cool, and it's definitely a dope shoe for the collection. Not as wearable. Um, as you could probably tell just from looking at the shoe, I really haven't ever worn it too much. 
I want to say I've worn it maybe three times. And I got these back in 2008. Let's get into the shoe. Starting with the gold bottom, the black midsole with the gold stitching. The entire upper is all patent leather. So around the eyelets, toe box, side panel, and around the back, you have that gold patent leather with gold stars on it. Then you have a black patent leather swoosh, which leads back to the black tab back there with the gold uh, Nike SB stitching. All gold tongue, including the lining and then your gold patch with the black uh, SB stitched in. All black inside, black Zoom Air sole with the gold um, hit of Zoom Air right there. All around dope pack, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you what all four of these look like on feet. Here's a look at the Korhari Dunks on feet. That all patent leather really makes the shoe stand out, really dope, the gradient effect. Gotta love the fact that the basket is on the back rather than Nike. All around very original shoe. Dope. Here's a look at the Michael Lau Blazers on feet. Really crazy. Um, the colors, you know, make it all seem like not too much is going on, but if you really look at the shoe, so much detail. I love them. Crazy. Here's a look at the Trickstar Blazers on feet. Very dope shoe. You can wear it with anything. It's mainly all black. The gold really pops. The stars really pop. A great release. Here's a look at the Trickstar Dunk Lows. Really eye-catching. Uh, as I stated before, it's, it's not as easily worn, but when you do wear it, really dope. Nice shoes. Alright guys, uh, as always, make sure to check out superkicks.com. You're going to find these four shoes and any other shoes you might be looking for on there, so definitely check them out. Definitely check out the review section for all the dope videos. Check out frontalations.com. I'll be posting all my videos as well as everyone else's videos and just a whole bunch of dope stuff, so definitely check it out. And once again, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed all the other videos, and I'll def definitely be back with many more videos for you guys. Alright? Peace.